Hello folks, welcome back to another video everybody. Welcome in folks. So today we're going to be checking out the Dipmonds Park Halloween house everybody here in Prospect Heights. Um, I meant to get off on church but the train skipped Church Avenue. So, But it's okay because the haunted house is closer. It's more closer to Beverly Road. So we're going to go and check out that house everybody. So yeah, let's get excited folks. This is gonna be a 45 minute video, so stay tuned everyone. Sheesh, it is very dark here, yikes. Got dark so fast. Yeah, it gets dark really fast in this neighborhood. Definitely does. But I'm just gonna do my video and get on out of here. I'm gonna find the house. I'm gonna see where that is. Cause I was waiting for it to get dark before I do this video. So, well, I get out of work early, but if I get out of work at 5 o'clock, then, yeah. If I got off work at, at around, like, 5, 4 or 5, right around there, then I wouldn't have to wait this long. But being I get out of work around 2 p.m., I had to wait a while. I have to wait, like, a good four hours for it to get dark. But it's finally getting dark now. So we're going to check out the houses. I saw this house on a YouTube live stream. So, and now, and I saw how good it looked. I, I really saw how good it looked. So I definitely want to go and check out this full declarated house here. So I really want to go and check it out. That's really attracting um, some attention. I don't know if it's attracting a lot of attention. But um, well, I'm also going to go and check out the Halloween declarations in um, Diker Heights. So stay tuned for that video, folks. So definitely stay tuned, everybody. So that I'm going to do a stream on that one um, coming up this week. So stay tuned for that, everybody. So that will be happening soon. But yeah, here we go move over here oh look at that wow here it is here it is and the great thing is that it's not even a weekend so yeah um it's not even a weekend so get this whole entire space to yourself and just take a look at it you guys Looks so damn incredible, folks. Yeah, I was like, I just, I'm gonna decide I'm gonna do a video on this instead of a live stream because I really don't want to waste a live stream on it. So, now there was like several of these all over the neighborhood, then I will definitely do a stream on it, but I don't really see a point in doing a live stream. So I was like, I'm gonna just do a video instead for this Thursday. Oh, look at the dragon, everybody. You can see the dragon. And then this is the house right here. so incredible really really incredible here it's definitely drawing some attention i think if i would have came here on a weekend this whole area would be packed so good thing i decided to come on a monday <sighs> to show you how the inside of this right here <laughs> Oh! <laughs> 
that looks really good. It did get dark here pretty fast, so I was like, this is like the best timing. I did pick the right day because it is getting dark earlier. Now it gets dark before 7, so that's a good thing. So I don't have to wait until at least 7 or 8 at least. And I still had a long wait for it to get dark anyways. But pretty for the next couple of weeks, it will be getting dark around uh, 4.30. So I won't have that much of a long wait. people property but I just want to show you guys the main focus of this video is uh, this beautiful house right here out here in Brooklyn so this one is called the Dittman's Park um, haunted ha haunt Halloween house that's what it's called you guys could probably go google it and find out show you guys this is freaking insane look at this guys people can really I mean really decorate I mean to be honest they can really decorate there's no need for me to get that close because this is actually somebody's house so I really want to respect their property I'm not go on a lawn or on a porch so I'm definitely not doing that my zoom in camera just to show you guys this so if you guys want to know where this takes place at um everyone this is on um Yeah, but um, if you guys want to know where, where this house takes place at, this is on 1306 Albany, no, uh, yeah, Albany Road, Albany Marine Road, I believe. So if you just want to check this out, if you want to experience it in person, this is on 1306 Albany Marine Road. And you can experience it for yourself if you're in the New York City area. Um, you just take the um, you just take the Q train to Beverly Road and just get off and walk to um, Albany Road. Or you could Google it. You could look at it yourself. So I'm not gonna put the address in the description because it is somebody's home. So I don't want to put too much information on here, but. That's if you want to experience it for yourself and you want to look at it and you want to see it for yourself. But um, I advise everybody not to get too close because this, this is somebody property. But like if you're going to come and get videos and photographs and all that stuff, make sure you have a camera that, that can like really zoom in. You can be able to see. 
So this is pretty cool here. It's really, really cool here. But yeah, this is 1306 Albury, 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 Marie Row. Um, but it's A L B E. Yeah, A L B E Marie Road. A L B E Marie Road. If you want to check this out for yourself in person, if you want to check out the declarations for yourself, but it is 1306 A L B E Marie Road. So I can't see the name correctly it's hard to pronounce it but but this is where this is actually at so but if you guys are enjoying this video make sure you guys give this a like everybody give this video a like and don't forget to uh don't forget to subscribe if you are for more content everybody make sure you guys subscribe for more content if you really want to see more content on this channel look at this it's freaking awesome but yeah i saw this on a youtube live stream and i was like i gotta check this out man i seriously have to check it out so I was gonna do a live stream too, but like I was like, what's the point in me doing a live stream? So and I'll just do a 45 minute video. But yeah, here it is everybody. So if you guys really wanna see. I thought this was really, really incredible. Whoever did this, shout out to this person who did a super good job on this. He really, really did an outstanding job on this because it is so good on this um, house right here. It's, it's incredible. Like, I'm seriously in love with the declarations. It's really, really awesome. So I really like it, though. Everybody here is coming and getting their photos here. That's what everybody's doing. This looks so incredible right here. It's really good. Let's take another tour around here. I think I guess we can get closer after everybody's getting closer to here. So we're moving. Get the spider, everybody. There goes the spider right there. Zoom in a bit better on this. Now this is definitely given Halloween. Like this is what you call real Halloween decorations here. Like this is what you actually call real Halloween decorations. Because this is so incredible. Like just look at it.
I know Dr. Heights has a, I know Dr. Heights does um, Halloween decorations, but I haven't been to the Halloween decorations yet in Dyker Heights. Um, so I can't say if Dyker Heights is better than this. So I'll just have to see. But this is not in Dyker Heights. This is in Prospect. Um, what is this? This is in Prospect Heights. Actually, it's in Prospect Heights. Um, it's spelled two minutes away from Beverly Road. Two minutes away. If you want to know how you can get here, you can take the Q train to uh, Beverly Road, get off, and walk to A B, yeah, A L B E Marie Road. I can't say the full name correctly, but this is 1306 A L B E Marie Road. And you just take the Q train and walk to this avenue right here, L E. No, yeah. Why well, I say L E? A L B E Marie Road. I'm sorry to confuse people, but if you want to know where this is, this is 1306 A L B E Marie Road. And if you want to experience it for yourself, so that's the only information I'm going to give out. So, so. It's, and it's about five, it's about three minutes away from the train, so it's not far. I will check it out. Oh, you want to see the Vista? This is like the best shit ever, man. This is the, this is like this is like the best Halloween decorations I've ever seen in my life. Like the the like really the best, man. I've never seen no Halloween decoration like this. <laughs> On out of all the out of all the Halloween decorations I've seen, especially here in New York City, this is the best so far. This is seriously the best Halloween decorations I've seen so far here. There you have uh, Pinocchio. There goes Pinocchio. I'm zooming. The Pinocchio looks really scary, though. Looks scary, than, way scarier than the one from Shrek. It does look pretty evil, though. Look like the Joker. <laughs> the 
got that clown head twisted a bit. One scary thing here. And then we have the dragon up here. I'm gonna zoom in on the dragon so y'all can see. Now this part almost almost had me because somebody came close to it and something just jumped right on out, but it ain't getting me, so. Like something comes out of there, the spider would just jump out. That almost had me right there. <laughs> almost freaking had me. And then you got the ghost, you are the ghost. what this part is it does look kind of creepy though Get too close to that, it'll pop up, it'll pop right on you. Yeah, I was distracted. I was like, good thing I wasn't too close, but I was really distracted, y'all. on this video I'm not even, not even paying attention to over there I'm not even paying attention to there I'm so focused on the video you guys so focus on the decorations close to that spider thing or that black house thing that is it's just popping up on people it's, it's definitely scaring the shit out of people it definitely is and here we go everybody we'll be here at least another 20 more minutes everybody and then i'm gonna end this video everybody for y'all hope y'all enjoyed it Hope you guys are enjoying this premiere video here of the, um, the best decorated haunted house in NYC. I think that's what I'm going to name this video, name this premiere video.
going to come back here. Um, maybe, I don't know. It's going to be kind of hard because I'm thinking about going to see the, ho the Halloween decorations out in um, Diker Heights. Because this is, this is still freaking far from Diker Heights. So, this, I'm not even, this is nowhere near Diker Heights. If this wasn't back to Heights, I would have left super early. I'll make sure I got to Brooklyn at least by 4 p.m. at least. If this was really in back to Heights, but then it would take me much longer to get home. If it, if it was all the way down, if it was way down here, because there's no, there's no trains that run to back to Heights. So you gotta take a train to the nearest train is the R on 86th street and then you gotta walk a good 10 blocks and then i could take the end 8th avenue but it's a good five to ten blocks from diker heights still it's still a good long it's still a good long amount of walk from the train it's longer than rock it's a lot longer than what i walk from the train in my neighborhood the bat just could pop up. Where's the bat at? I didn't see no bat. Oh snap, the bat just popped up. Sorry. There goes the bat, folks. Dad. You see that coming. What other, what other surprises they set up? while decorating this house. Didn't see that surprise in the jackbox. Sick. Look at it. It looks so damn scary, man. Yeah, I would be scared if that shit was real, man. Like, that is a big-ass spider. Oh, damn. Look at that. That bat just popped up. It, it probably waits until you get closer, then boom. That's how it gets you. So that was really, really good. That's how it really, really, really gets you.
So if you guys miss, for anyone that missed this video while it was premiering, um, you guys can go back later and watch the replay. Everybody. So if you want to, um, yeah, so if you miss this premiere video of this beautiful, I mean, beautiful decorated Halloween, no worries. You guys can always go back and watch the replay at your own time. It's the great thing about YouTube, you can watch replays of videos, of premieres and live streams as well. That way you don't have to wait for the next one. <laughs> he got this. Sneaky little guy. So sneaky. So here's another sneaky outfit over here. Seriously, ice cream in the middle of the freaking fall. It's not even hot enough for ice cream. Normally around this time, like I think once you get past September, you don't see no more ice cream trucks until at least the spring of next year. Oh, this sneaky little thing right here. This damn thing is sneaky, this bat right here. I ain't getting too close for people. Yeah. Here's the thing though, like, people aren't paying an extra attention, so if people get too close, it'll scare the crap out of you. The bat that I just showed you. Let's go back over here and take a look. really, really good. So I'm gonna stay on for another 10 minutes, folks, and then um, afterwards, I'm gonna end the video. I wouldn't mind doing an hour, but um, I don't have enough storage on my phone, so I, I have to cut it down to 45 minutes. Oh, there it is, there it is. thing is so sneaky Just look at it it's so freaking sneaky <laughs> it's sneaky as hell but then the bat too is the same way you have the bear i think it's a bear or something like that it's a bear and it comes out of its cave you get too close and then boom like, boom, it'll pop right at you. I love the 
had that in um any lower See same thing here with the back. Right here. This is another thing that will pop right at you. So you guys can be able to see what the whole house, what this side looks like. It looks pretty good here. Yeah. This house looks really, really haunted. It really does look super haunted. It definitely does. It looks super scary though. This looks like a beautiful home, though. So we're hanging here for another five more minutes, and then I'm gonna end the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it as well. I'm gonna get some, some, I'm gonna get something on my TikTok. I gotta get some videos for my TikTok and my other social media platforms. get some pictures when I'm done with this video as well.
I'm sorry for the next person that comes in front of that <laughs> house. I feel sorry for the next person that comes right in front of the house. Maybe you can get it on camera, but let's keep our mouth shut. Attention, it'll get you if you're not paying attention. I mean, I guess that's the best part about about. I guess that's probably the best part about having this set up at night. Because it's so dark, people can't see them. Boom. And like, boom. It pops right at you. Yeah, I think we got enough for the action. Um, we'll get one last footage, circle around the house, and then we'll end the video, folks. So we'll do that. Stay for another minute and then we'll sign on everybody. All right, everybody, so I'm gonna wrap up this video, everybody. I've been on here for 46 minutes. I'm not gonna stay any longer because if I stay longer, then my storage is gonna give me problems. Anyways, folks, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. And I'll see you guys in my next video. So there are more videos coming up, everybody. Stay tuned, we have what we got the last thing we have left is the holiday season so we're going to be seeing a lot of christmas stuff in november and december and then we have the bryant park ice skating ring 
as well. We have not just the Bryant Park Ice King Ring, we have the Winter Village. Um, and we also have the Rockefeller Center Skating Park. We got the Rockefeller Center Christmas Tree. We're gonna see a lot of Christmas stuff. So that's, we still got more to go, everybody. So stay tuned, folks. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Take care, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, folks. Take care, and enjoy the rest of your day. Take care, folks.